and I'm tired from just talking. Hey you guys, it's Alex Q, and today we're gonna be doing some booty guru things. When I say booty guru, I mean beauty guru. So let's not get it twisted, I'm not showing you my So in today's video, we're going to be kind of giving our face some self care. I just shaved my face, she's looking a little bit rough, she's had some sun in her life, and she needs some taking care of. I'm just now realizing that red really brings out the red undertones in my skin, so hopefully that doesn't bother you. In this video, we're going to be using some water blending lip mask. Let's do the beauty, beauty guru. Beauty guru! So we're gonna be using a Nuni water blending lip mask. I haven't used it yet, and it says it's an overnight lip mask that soothes and alleviates stressed lips. I don't know what that means, but my lips are a little bit dry right now, and like I can feel like stress. But we're not just gonna be using this, we're gonna be using the Glam Glow Mud Mask just to give our skin this like a slap in the face. It's also an exfoliate, so it's really nice to do after your skin has like had some time to like create a layer of like dead skin and you really want that like extra brightness. So let's open Nuni first. Let's open Nuni first. Let's open Nuni first. <clears throat> Oh my god. Can I just rip it open? You did this to yourself, Nuni. Looks like the yes. Boom, did it, beauty guru. And we have our Glam Glow. Youth Mud, beauty guru, beauty guru. What I'm gonna do first is I'm gonna add this water blending mask and then I'm gonna add the Glam Glow because this says overnight and I'm going out tonight. It is now four o'clock. I have an hour to get ready. Ooh, so I'm gonna be late. Oh, cute, is this just oil? Comes with a cute little scooping spoon. That's fun. It just smells like oil and maybe a sweet thing. It just says apply it to your lip. Should I get closer? Do you guys want me to get closer? Is this close enough? You know what, let's not. Is that too far away? Are you feeling neglected? All right, so this says add this to our face. Ugh. It's really greasy. Okay. So, I, I just can't imagine this on your lips overnight. Ooh, she just ate a bucket of chicken. I just don't see how this layer of oil is something that you would want on your face at night and how it doesn't get on your pillow. Look at this face. Mm, look at these lips. <laughs> so, for this Glam Glow mask, you want to Wash your face, we did it, check. And then what I like to do before putting mask on is give it an extra je ne sais quoi. I like to also take witch hazel or any type of astringent, alcohol free, protect your skin, and then just give yourself like a secondary cleaning. You will find things that you did not realize were on your face. So basically just take it to all the places that you're gonna like cover your face, it's gonna find like dirt that you didn't even know you had on your face. Like it's crazy how after you just wash your face, scrub that beach, and then it still finds something that's nasty. <laughs> now that we've uh, wiped our face with our cotton round, we're going to uh, dip into... If you follow me on Instagram, you know I've been using this mud mask because the girl is low. It's such a good mask and it makes your face feel so rejuvenated afterwards. Ugh, I don't even understand. It says stir and apply a thin layer to clean skin. Expect a tingle tactic tingling effect in 10 minutes or less. Remove with water in a circular motion, AKA exfoliate your face. If you cannot handle strong exfoliates, I don't recommend this for sensitive skin. Because when I tell you that it exfoliates the hell out of it, it really gets, <laughs> if that was an exfoliate, that would be your feeling. Should I get closer? I'ma say no. I don't have great skin. <laughs> so basically, we wanna like mix it up. That's actually what the instruction says. Basically warming it up just to kind of loosen it so it applies to the skin easier. And then literally go in, thin layer. I feel like I've been here before. I feel like I've done this for you. But who cares? Love, love, love. You know what we're gonna do? We're just gonna go all the way in because a lot of times with my beard and everything, I don't get to get this part of my skin very often. So I like to whenever I do shave my face, is literally get all up in there. I'm gonna look like that moon emoji. I have done this before. 
<laughs> I remember the moon emoji now. Are there any products out there that you guys would recommend to me? Because I love trying new products and I'm getting close to the end of some of my products. I'm willing to try anything once. God, I look bananas. This actually, this, my forehead has been such a problematic area for me recently that it's making me lose my mind. This is why I started pulling my hair back in the first place because my hair has gotten so long and in your face that it literally just, all the natural oils just kind of sit right there on top of my skin and it has been breaking me out. You know how they said thin layer and I've just been spackling this stuff on? And my skin's really sensitive. I really do like to just go in there and it up. So we're gonna wait for 10 minutes, wait for this bad boy to dry, and then we're gonna exfoliate it off. I don't think I'm gonna show the exfoliating part because it's it requires a lot of water and the sink, and it gets messy. So we will come back soon, and we will, bye. I feel like the camera's not loving this this color of skin right now is not giving me the best lighting, but I wanted to show you guys what it looks like when it's all dried, once you feel the tingly effects, then you wanna go in with some water, a little dab, 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 and literally just rub it off like this so that you can get the full exfoliating effect. I will come back once I have cleaned my face and then show you what I do afterwards. If that's something that will interest you, you can always uh, fast forward. Okay guys, I am back and at a little bit of a closer angle so that you can see, like I feel like my skin is completely fresh. It's super soft, but as you can see, like the exfoliating is kind of intense. You can see that I have a little bit more redness to my skin. What we like to do afterwards, for me at least, is I like to continue on with my skincare treatment. I like to add some essence. You can use a cotton round, sometimes I do this too, is just so I can get the full cooling effect, is add it to a clean palm. Just a little rub it in, and then, oh my God, I feel, it feels painful because that, ooh, girl. This is a Luna Sleeping Night Oil by Sunday Riley. I got this in my Treely Beauty Box and honestly, it's so pretty. I didn't get to show you the inside before because I was being very stingy and selfish, but this is what it looks like. It has this super cute, uh oh blue color. It's very expensive, so. Luna works throughout the night to deliver youthful looking, luminous, even toned skin in the morning. Retinol ester reduces the appearance of pores and wrinkles while fighting the visible signs of premature aging, fine lines, uneven texture, age spots, dryness, and dullness. So I'm gonna take just a little bit, that's a lot of it, and then I'm gonna put it on my face. Mm. And you only wanna put a little bit because you don't wanna change the color of your skin. Oh, it smells like freaking cookies. Jesus Christmas. Ooh, she's shiny. For the end, as you can see, I'm very shiny, but I'm not fully moisturized yet. I like to go in with this Tatcha water gel. This is so light, so good. You only need one pump, because it's so good. It like spreads all over your face. You see the shine, it's not being hidden. And honestly, that's pretty much all I have for this video. I almost forgot what it was about. I guess it was like, skincare slash what I do, blah, 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 blah. If you guys like me doing videos like this, if you guys want a more in-depth, in-your-face type feel when it comes to beauty products, please let me know. Comment below. I do read them, I do listen, and I'm always looking for new things to try. So feel free to recommend them to me because Coming up with ideas yourself is hard. <laughs> if you guys like this video, give me a thumbs up. It's super helpful. If you guys want to continue seeing more of my face, this perfectly new glowed face just for you, hit that subscribe button. Do not forget to hit the notification bell because sometimes it lets you know when I upload videos. And just remember you guys, your smile is infectious. Have a great day. I look crazy. Yeah. Ooh, guys, I've been working out. What does that look like? Ooh. Mm-hmm.